Hiya! As you know, I really, really, really like birthdays. As in really, 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 really like birthdays. This top, in fact, was a birthday present from a friend. Happiness is expensive, that it is, my friend. One of the ways I really annoy my friends is by counting down to it. I'll be like, oh, it's three months from my birthday, oh, it's two months from my birthday, oh, it's five days from my birthday. I get very excited about it. But I think that's good. I think it's good that I have milestones and goals and loads of people say, oh, you're wishing your life away. You just need to enjoy the moment. Yeah, well, what if I'm not enjoying the moment? What if I want to look forward to these things? Which I do, by the way, because I'm so excited about it that when I get there, and it's just as amazing as I thought it would be, it's great. Obviously, if it's not as great as I thought it would be, then I'm sorely disappointed and wish I hadn't wished my life away, but one of us. So with that said, here's 10 things Ellie's looking forward to. Please note that these are all approximate-ish because some of them I worked out myself and some of them I used a internet countdown thingy. Three months and five days until the Captain America DVD comes out, which I have already pre-ordered, of course. I was very proud when I was on Amazon and I saw that Richard Armitage was listed in front of Chris Evans, who plays Captain America himself. Staying with a the comic theme, it's only eight months and five days until the Avengers come out. I really, really, really can't wait for this film. 176 days, which translates into about seven months until the Hunger Games are out. Team Peter all the way. Four months and ten days till The Woman in Black comes out, starring Daniel Radcliffe. I'm studying this book for GCSE English and actually my exam is about this book so I'm so glad it's coming out before then and we're all going to go see it and we're all going to be screaming and it's all going to be a laugh and Daniel Radcliffe looks really fit. 441 days until The Hobbit. I cannot wait that long. 400. Only one day till the Doctor Who series finale, The Wedding of River Song. Alex Kingston is such a bamf and I love River and I could just, if the whole series was about her, I wouldn't mind. 123 days till the next Harry Potter film, lol joke. One month and 25 days until the sequel for this comes out, it's called Crossed, it's amazing. You know, it's really good that I checked for this because it turns out that I actually pre-ordered two copies of this, one in July and one in September, that's how much I'm looking forward to it. Something you'll be excited about, especially 106 days until The Fault in Our Stars comes out. And of course, 11 months and 12 days until my next birthday. School's alright, a bit tired, but I'm always a bit tired. Yeah, year 11 is hard work. Surprise, surprise. It's fine, I'll be fine, it'll be fine. If it doesn't work out, I'll go be a plumber or something. My handwriting is proper awful.